Hi, hello everyone. This is Kala. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having a great week so far. For this week's video, I'm going to review two of my favorite back from Chanel and they are from the exact same collection, which is the most iconic collection, which is the classic black collection. So these are the most timeless bag from Chanel um, over time. As you can see, this one is a black one and this is pink black. And let me tell you, what's the difference about this two? This is the small size. This is the mini size. So this video is really created for you to help you to better understand what is the difference between a small classic bag and a mini classic bag. So you can have a better choice about which one you should be getting first or if you're struggling with getting a small one versus get a mini one, here is the guide to help you today. So, um, as I told you earlier that these two bags are both from the same collection, the Classic Lab. However, the leather is a little different. The pink one is in the lambskin with the super hot wear. And the small one is a black color. It's cotton skin with a gold hot wear. But the key is, what is the difference in terms of the size and the capacity and the inner structure? So let's check it out right now. So first thing first, let's compare the size. Well, you can actually get the um, actual measurement online, but I think this is probably more visual to tell you the difference. So I'm going to just compare side by side first so you can have a clear view about the size. So clearly, I think from the waist perspective, the smaller one, which is the mini one, is probably an inch shorter, which just totally makes sense because this is mini, this is small. And I think if you are comparing the height of the two pairs, it's actually quite similar. It's probably half an inch shorter this way. And I think they're pretty much exact the same capacity here. You can see, um, I think that even the smaller one, which is the mini one, is a little wider. So we'll check how many stuff we can fit and you have a better idea later. But another important thing that I don't, don't want to miss um, is the chain. So as we all know that the chain for the small one, you can wear as a shoulder bag if you are using the double chain or if you want to actually use this as a crossbody, it's doable depending on your height as well. <laughs> um, not for everyone, some people feel like this is too short to wear as a crossbody. I think that's totally fair um, because I'm really petite, so this works perfect for me. But let's see in terms of the lengths of the two straps and which is definitely gonna tell you something. All right, so that is very obvious. So I'm holding these two bags at the same level, and you can see the mini, the chain is much longer than the small one. So if you want to do a crossbody bag, definitely get the mini one. But if you want to get a shoulder one, you should get the small one. And in terms of the price, I think that's a key differentiator that helps a lot of people to understand why they should be getting the big one or um, getting the smaller one. I mean big one, I mean the small size and smaller one here, I mean the mini one. So right now, as of 2020, um, the, today is July the 16th, so I think this is currently selling at $5,800 US dollars, and this one is only $3,500 if I remember correctly. So that's a huge difference. That's nearly 200, well, not 200, it's 2,300 US dollars more. And you have to think about a tax and everything on the top of the um, original price of the two bags. So that's a huge difference, right? If you're thinking about you have never had a classic flap and you want to start with something like a conic and you're thinking about a small and a mini, I would say probably started with mini. That's a lot cheaper um, and the capacity is very similar. And let's check it out right now. So today I have my work phone. I have my personal phone, so two phones. This is um, iPhone 8 Plus and this is iPhone X. And I have a little card case. Uh, also my little wallet is from Grupo Gari. 
you're interested in, feel free to check my videos in the past. And I have my AirPod, always. And you can't miss my lipstick. The Silk Gucci. Alright, so let's fit all of this into my bag first. Um, I have videos definitely for um, the bags um, individually of all of this too. So if you're interested to see the detailed review of the two purse, feel free to check out my videos. Um, but I just really want to do the comparison today so you can have a better understanding. It's quite easy to put everything in here. See? That's the mini. Alright, you definitely have space here for your additional stuff, your keys, um, or other accessories that you want to carry. And it is very easy to close it up. All right? so um, these are the things that you've already seen. You still have a lot of space there. So if you're worried about um, the mini's capacity, comparison to the small, you should be feeling okay. Alright. Now it's a turn for our small classic flap. I love this double flap. As happened times. And again, the same thing. Uh, first is the biggest. That's my purse. Oh, not work my work phone. And personal phone in. Oh, I love this little pocket for my lipstick. I showed you in the last videos. There is a specific pocket for your lipstick, which is so sweet of the design. And this is my little card case. We'll just put it in. Sometimes you can actually put um, your lipstick just in a big pocket, so it helps you to organize things better. That's just my personal experience. Okay, so let's sh let me show you the um, capacity here. So I mean, I think it's quite obvious that the small one would be able to hold a little more, and it has more structure in terms of the pocket inside, um, and outside, and in the back. I mean. There is a pocket on the back of the small one, on the mini one, sorry. But um, I think this one is providing a lot more. Um, you can even put your stuff between the two flaps, uh, whichever you want. Um, that only applies if you have a lot of things that you need to get them really organized. But otherwise, I use the big compartment like most of the time and that's good enough. You don't want to carry so much in your Chanel bag and make sure this is going to be your lifetime bag. So this is definitely a lot more capacity, I would say, and to close it up fairly easy as well. So now you should have better understanding. I think capacity-wide, of course, the um, small classic flap is definitely going to hold a little bit more than the mini one, which is very natural. But I think the difference is not very, very huge. It's probably not going to be a big deal. If you're using this bag just for like a date night um, or just going out for the day and you don't have to carry a lot of stuff, these are both actually working out. And especially a small one, it's very convenient and especially you're just want to be casual and you don't want to wear a shorter bag, you want to wear it as a crossbody and this one would probably stand out a little more. And yes, price is a big um, factor. So these are today's review about the mini versus the small. How do you feel? A better understanding about those two? Do you have your mind made already? I hope you did. And I really hope today's video helped you a lot. And again, this is Nicola. Thank you so much for watching my video. And I will see you next time. Bye.